Hello, and welcome back to The Darkest Dungeon 2. Right, we last left off, I believe we were one region out from the boss, the final boss. This will be our second attempt, this time we've gone a fair bit more uh, defensive, looking, at more, looking more at sustainability of our characters, we have beaten a boss, we do have a trophy, Each we have looked out with the Pygmy Pliskin, in the equation of your fate. so we're getting a lot of additional healing here. I believe I did all the sawing out of everything before the end of the last episode, so we will be on our merry way. Um, we do have some relationship problems with, yep, Damien. Resentment. The slowest and deadliest poison of them all. Right. So, if he uses a heal, he'll make our runaway blind. If she uses a basic attack, he becomes weak. Though it doesn't matter all that much because he is more about applying blight, so it's not that big of a deal. Fester, how then we don't even oh god that's gonna lock that skill into use, isn't it? And then these make he that's gonna make Junior weak, which we don't care about. That's gonna make him blind, which is a bit annoying. The howling ends the annoying one there. I, I do wish it wouldn't lock in skills that you don't currently have equipped. Honestly, I just kind of hate the skill locking system that's tied to that anyway. I'm generally speaking not a big fan Rewards. of the uh, the Resignation. what's it system what would you call it here the um, yeah I'm not really a particularly big fan of uh, the relationship system yeah it looks like Iron Swan is now not in use we've not been using if it bleeds much I think we're using Iron Swan more so. We won't really be able to do much from the second row if we get moved there, so we want to keep her front and centre, I guess, now. Um, she's got the... Yeah, tons of HP, but because she's got Bloodthirsty, which we have locked in, she's still got a similar amount of damage regardless. Um, there is an Oasis. Uh, what was our extra condition here? I think it was yes to visit the Oasis. Glad I've looked. There's going to be more Oblivion Tears and things. We probably want to go Oasis. Then probably into the Resistance Encounter to try and get those Mastery Tokens up into a Hospital. Then a Creature Den. Um, we'll Scout, I guess. But it's not that much of Scouting, I suppose. But it, may, it might come in handy. Right. The value of such a view is matched only okay. by unsettling awfulness. We are let's see, looking pretty good so far. What have we got here? Um Right, so we can go Resistance, Ingress, oh, well we can fight, fight or fight, at least it's going to put everyone's relationships up, so there's that. Right. Good news, these are weak to fire. And we have a bunch of fire piercing anyway, but yeah, we are gonna annihilate this. Battlement and vexation. Let's put a consecration on. And we'll start let's see. Let's start hitting the foot soldier because we'll deal blight, which ignores the block. A 
promising development. Okay, here we go. Yep. Bit of horror. Let's try and end this somewhat abruptly. If we can, we don't be taking too much of that. And oh no, our dedicated healer is becoming slightly weaker. Right. They're gone. The corpse is gone. And now, we can start working this guy over. Hmm. Stress is going to be the main problem here. We're getting a lot of damage over time put on him now. <clears throat> right. Nearly. Yeah, just about hitting the halfway point. We're getting loads of... Uh, damage it over time effects is not going to be long now. We'll be dead in no time. Even more blight. We will probably want to try and lower some of Junior's stress if we can. If we get the barbarian to have a go, we might want to quickly. Uh... Mm. Okay, maybe we don't bother then, since we've got horror on us now. Right. And that hit at the, that kill at the end is so a of stress a bit. And, yeah. This work is noble. Nice not having to worry about inventory slots at the moment since we've got you know fifty odd or whatever it is. <laughs> nice to just not have to worry. Um, we don't need to do the layer, so we will go. I think. Yeah, we can go to an ingress. Mind you, it's. Uh, do we want to? They can be tricky. Because if we go to the Ingress, oh mind you, it can give mastery. Yeah, we probably should. Oh no, no, we don't, we don't. There's the uh, visit an oasis. I mean, it's only worth uh, three candles. Um, so we go there, then to an oasis. Then probably swing to the resistance encounter in the hospital. Yeah. Okay, that's not too bad. And we do want the uh, oasis, the stress heal and actual heal that the uh, spring water gives you is really good. It's a great item to have right at the end. But we also want to swing by the hospital. I've got some uh, cash to spend, but admittedly not as much as I thought I had. But we can, des we can definitely get a few pulses while we're over there. Okay, so we can get some supplies, loads of food. I'll get our wagon fixed up. Um we keep going we will lose one uh, no we'll go up here cross it's a barricade we'll be down to one wheel here go there then probably the assistance we'll be to zero wheels I think we can make it without I don't think we need to do that I think we can go for the food 
in they this did not world. like that. Wealth is worthless without purpose. You know, I'll be honest, I've not been like looking at what we're actually doing at these assistance encounters. I've just been clicking on the one, one that gives us a reward. Because usually the ones where you spend flame and get stuff, you know, more, stu uh, more stuff, are usually the ones where you're robbing them or something, aren't they? I, I didn't really pay attention to that then. It's like, ooh, food, nom. Right. A refreshing so who knows, maybe we've just robbed a lot of people, I have no idea. Um, that's the spring water, isn't it? Yeah, the other one was going to give us stress healing, but... Yep, there it is. Just gonna hold on to that until the end, I guess, but I suppose we could equip it now. No reason why we couldn't, but I might try and use these contraptions and that beforehand. Um We want to try resistance encounter, don't we, for the uh yeah. For the mastery. We'll get to the hospital. And I want to buy more poultices, especially if they are, um, what is it, restorative herbs. The loathing howls. I guess it's not a poultice, is it? it's restorative, whatever. Anyway, I want some of those. I think we've got a chance to actually produce those, haven't we? Um, yeah, chance to produce restorative items at each location, so yeah. You'd think we'd have been getting a few more of those, but nope. Honestly, a lot of the medical equipment on the back of the thing really doesn't work that well. Right. Bullseye Barrett. I've seen them before. He's a particularly dangerous one. We want him dead right away. Too bad we don't have a uh, what's it um, iron swan there. Because that'd be really nice. Yeah. We wanna watch out for that bullseye. What's his face at the back? Let's make this one blind and then give it a smack. Can get rid of those damage of times. And now but deadly all the same. We should be fine to go for this guy at the back. As soon as we get someone who can. Right, she should get some bonus damage from this. Yep. <laughs> okay. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Um, he does have some death blow resistance. Oh, that's point. We can, uh... I'm going to use these bear traps as well, see if I can get some bleeding on them. Right. There's that. There it goes. Appliance of harm. 
Get some nasty bleed on them. But luckily, if they've got bleeding, it means that we can uh, cauterize the wound. Damaging while it's vulnerable. They're nearly gone. Right, so let's just try and, and carelessness. get them. All marks of the unprepared. Get rid of the bleeding on her. We'll de stress a little. He's gonna. Right, there we go. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna need to get him some. Death blow hits so that it lowers his resistance, moves him towards actually dying. We can cautionize again. Holy hell, that was a that was a heal. Festive corpse. Don't do it. The smallest there we go. Can make all the difference. And we got the plus one mastery. Lovely. Um, searing scripture for the uh, flagellant. We have, uh, let's see, at the end of the round, remove one negative token and any combo that's been placed on it. Endure skill, steal negative tokens, steal combo to tokens. Um, twenty percent fire, uh, lower fire resistance as well. Yeah. Um, interesting, I guess. Ish. <laughs> the loathing bastards. Here we go, hospital. So decidedly inconvenient. At least we know what's coming. This could well be this Resigned hospital ship could well things. be. They waited for death. And the um they wait. Oh, that was the camera decided to go wonky there. But yeah, this could well be the game changer for us when we get to the uh, end here. Right, let's have a look. So, I don't think anyone has any diseases at the moment. Um, no restorative. There are some healing salves, though. Concoction and powder items. Um, Fairly certain we are actually, yeah, lacking a final medical item, aren't we? I'll buy it. Ooh, okay. It's not exactly what we're wanting, but tonics, tinctures, I'll take and those. remedies. The science of hope. I'll take those. Okay, that'll do. That'll do exactly fine, that. Right. What we can do with that, because if you remember correctly, at the very end... And we will go, um... Creature down here. At the very end... Ahead, we do have to face an entire section of the, the fight. And where it is basically just, um... It's just loads of blight that's been dealt to us. With this, we can pretty much negate the chance of being blighted. 
Uh, we've got something else that'll do bleed as well when we get to the end, so we can... Oh, wow, that's a... Right, so we'll give them one strength each, but we'll give us additional crit. Okay. A risk reward. So they're stronger and will hit hard, but we're, we're, we're guaranteed to crit. Elite enemies. Oh, bonus health and damage. Uh, maybe that was a bad idea. Oh, it only gave him the crit. Oh no. What have we done? Right, let's get some Any being, however horrid, can be brought to heal. That inflicted burn? Okay. Oh god, that one's got a crit. Kill him. She's gonna get so much bleed on her. Okay, the blight worked. Um, so he's got 12. Down to 9. She's on 2 bleed already. For who knows One for six turns there. One more hit should yet do it. Let's just uh, remove that part, shall we? Steady yourself. And steady. Mm, the bleeding's getting a bit much now. Okay, this one's probably gonna burn, the one in the middle, so we're probably not that afraid of him. Um yeah, let's work this one over. Dead, it won't be long now. He's got seven blight, he's got nine HP only. We really want to get this one at the back now. But we do want to watch out for all this bleed stacking up. Um, we'll use that bear trap finally. Um, three bleed, one bleed, three bleed. That's for four turns, that's for five. Nah, but she can use Bloodlust and use that to buff herself if we wanted to. Um, I will just get something like that. Right, we'll buff her, plus 20% damage for a while. Um, the mutate has got 10 health left. I think they their health changes to be like a proportionate amount how much you take off or something, or maybe it's just a set heal or whatever, but yeah, they, they don't go straight all the way back to full, at least. That's what I'm getting at. Right, we'll finally put a concentration down. We are about to face the second phase of the fight. Unfortunately for us. Um, we are at least inflicting that burn. It's on 10 now. Ooh. 
maybe he, yeah, he can just, he might just burn to death at this rate. Right. Resolve your violence and apply it judiciously. Uh, just doing a bit of a stress heal and that. Right. Next round. Spiders. Oh, they could make us lose a few turns here, so to speak. Okay. Sweat soaked brows. Unsteady stances. We're getting very lucky though with the hits going through these dodges. We're getting very lucky. Right. Yeah, there's those dodges. Right. While he's not got any dodge, we'll quickly thrash him. Now he's got enough blight that he'll uh, melt away now. Um, on him next turn. Uh, on the, uh, yeah. The enemy and wanes. Okay. And uh. vexation. The outer dodge moves. This blight's getting a bit ridiculous at this point. Boom, heal. <laughs> to full, basically. Right. This uh, webbing one to be removed from the equation here. I just want to keep missing turns. Straightforward and effective. Six a turn is losing now. Heels in. Mistimed, misdirected. Nine or ten, yeah, I'm gonna say that's surely it. Can make all yeah. the difference. The one pleasant in the extreme. This Combat and no in items will be discounted. Plus one mastery. Excellent. Right, that'll be a big help just the before the end. We should try not to spend any more cash now, even though we're probably not going to get much more, but we might get some from this cash. I get some from the assistant. 
uh, thing here. Let us hmm. temper this world's cruelty. Hmm. Right, okay. Um, we can get here. We want to cut through these heal up as well if we can. Get some stress heals in. It's this one that's posting, it's just, yeah. Right, we're getting some bleeding. Hope I want to watch out for that. Um, look at this front unit. The enemy weakens and wanes. Okay. Flagellant can look after himself. We will self heal, that's beautiful, we all pissy if we heal the run away. Right. And like I said, this guy can go it alone for a bit. He should be fine. Oh, mind you. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna say, he's gonna have to heal, but also. He needs to move back one so he can use Lash's gift. And it keeps getting bleed. Mm. Cauterizing, please, Bonnet. There we go. This wound at least has been tended to. He'll need to heal up her in return and the looks things right. I would like to know what's causing him to go blind. Is it uh No, it's not a quirk. one of these abilities that no okay um does this make him no that stresses him out vestal ah when she uses judgment it's making him blind okay we might want to shy away from that then right oh i well, are gonna i went to heal her crap crap she's getting a bit Weakened here. We can at least get that off her. Right. Right, one's down. I don't think the dogs can actually reach the back lines, so I think for now at least we're safe, but we really shouldn't have let this even happen. Anyway, it's sorted now. <laughs> yeah, when we heal, we heal. Um, we could cauterize that, but I don't think there's all that much point. Um, Okay, so he's guarded, he's countering. Let's just go for the guy at the back then. Mm, 
battle hurt. But because she's bleeding, she can now cauterize herself. Hey. Best we're gonna try and avoid making Damien blind constantly uh, with her, so. Sod it, we've got loads of help. Oh, well, he did make us bleed and crit and do a load, so maybe it wasn't the best of ideas. But, oh well. Um, let's get rid of that winded. I think the way that the blood, uh, the bloodlust works here. I think it's when she targets a, an enemy with an attack who is bleeding while she's under the effects of this buff. I think that's how it's meant to work. Um, whatever, right, anyway, we'll just an smack away. Squandered. Missed, unfortunately. And that would have been a big hit, so we could have done a lot out of that, which we weren't able to. We have to heal. There's a chance we'll miss here, yep. Put consecration down. Buff her up again. Should do something, yep. Nearly got him. Still blind, of course. Right. One down. Not great. Yep. There goes everyone's relationships. <laughs> We've been awful since we got screwed over by that boss a while back. We've just not been able to stress heal properly. Really. Um oh, she's got five, we've got six. Um it's just self heal. Um who's going next? I really hate it when they go after them like this, you know, it's... Don't have to make you nervous. Right, um... Finish him. Yeah, there we go. Another impediment. Cleared with impunity. Got a heal. Double heal. Right, let's finish him off. Nearly. Nice to lie, how much is going to hit for you? Yeah. <laughs> right. I'm going to have to fester. Can't reach that far back. The blight might get him though. Before the end. This doesn't. Which it has. Right. Bit of a dodgy fight that. Way tougher than I was expecting that fight. Yeah, that, that's just a road fight, that. That was ridiculously difficult for a little road fight. Because we got there in bad shape, and that's what it was. Look upon their noble struggle, and be humbled by it. Right. We could get a combat item or we can just get more light. Uh, it's currently pitch as black, black as pitch, eh? Um, uh, sure, we'll get a combat item out of it, why not? In crisis, no gain is uh, insignificant. Not terrible. Right, 
Right, combat items. What have we got? We'll refill that. Put those in there. Um, Noisemaker, sure. An elementary problem, is it not? Go for the free stuff. Mind your wheels. They have wheels nothing are, left to give. Wheels are basically hanging off now. Right, but we've just got a couple of combat encounters and we're at the end then. Right. Oh yes, some adrenaline. Excellent. And some more uh, impermeable poultice. Whatever we call that. The blight resistance stuff. That should really help us at, uh, at the end here. Right. Pillaging brigands. Enriching themselves as the world collapses. Wicked hat. Ooh, good start. Let's see if we can finish this guy off. Good, good. Right, and... Hmm, look at almost, yeah, get in there, right. We'll put on the, uh, in fact, yeah, let's get that fire damage off. Start. The slow suffering begins. We'll test it. There we go. Give him some blight. Measured and steady. Creation down, right. Ooh. Fast. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. Right, to get some of that cleaned up. They inflict some really nasty burn, man. Yeah, four over four turns, that is not a joke. That's a lot of burn damage. And they hit pretty hard as well. So we'll definitely prioritise killing them first. Um, and let's see, four over three turns. Between two, two and three. Uh, well, this is over more turns. We will get that scene to... Should more or less seal their fate. Yep. And let's see, ten, that's gonna do six. That should just about push them over the edge, and it's doing burn damage, lovely. Right. A 
Excellent. We'll get some stress healing done. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. It's down to uh, what's it? Thirteen with four burn every round. Oh wow, she's actually hitting rather hard. Uh, he can. Yeah, he might just drop off now. Um, might as well look. We can't heal Messy. anything at the moment with Boudicus, so he's gone. Sweet reprieve. We get the mastery. Until the next test bits is of currency. Which, you know, little bits of currency could help, you know. Since everything will be discounted at the next shop, we actually might be able to get a few bits and bobs with this. I doubt it'll be all that much. Right. Here we go. The rampart. Loathing made manifest. Right, we're straight away working on the altar. Mind you, actually, we probably shouldn't work on the altar much, thinking about it. Yeah, he usually eats the altar here, doesn't he? Yeah. We probably just want to focus him down. Getting that blight. Consecration down. Get it down nice and early. Right. We're not doing very much at the moment. But he will soon run out of um, of regen. The enemy and we can be stacking these on for future turns. Right, there we go, he's eaten them. He's got more regen, annoyingly, but... Oh, and he's got a good box, right. We want to watch out for that. Yeah, we have to be very careful about that. Um... Solidarity may yet arrest this collapse. Ooh, I wish you wouldn't crit when you did it. Right. This is not good. Yeah, this is really bad. Um, and we've yet to really do damage to him because of all this bloody regen that he's got. Self heal, buff up the Hellion. Speaking of buffing up the Hellion, right, we get heal in here as well. What a welcome one, nonetheless. Ha. Right, we're finally chipping away. That's going to draw the uh, nasty damage over time effects. It does mean we can cauterize and use the uh, ministrations. 
this one at least so has been negated already. Lovely. Hopefully he's resisted the move. But it has then missed the attack. Right. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. careful here. He will eventually just kill this guy at the back, that's why I'm not really bothering that much with them. Um, administrations is on cooldown. Um, use the noisemaker again. Try to take attention off from our backline that are getting a bit hurt right now. Yep, as I mentioned, he does typically let go and kill his allies. As annoying as it is that he's got so much uh, regen and things, and it's just going to all go back. We have to keep in mind, though, that we are doing way more damage to him. Like, we've got him down to half, in spite of all the heals and buffs he's getting and so on. Um, this will trigger a, uh, what's it, uh, repost, um, you know what, we shouldn't do that this turn, um, just hide, We've got some block on her and some dodge, so yeah, we can use all that. Um, we can either heal them or. You know what? We'll heal Boudica. Vestal is going next. I think they might have their heal off cooldown now. Ah, wait, wait, hang on, yeah, the target needs to be low on health. Um. Ooh. I mean, it's not too bad. I didn't want Bonnie to attack him because she had vulnerable. So, she'd have got smacked like a truck. Um. Vestal here, even though the health's low, remember that they have a lot of base health, so it's actually on 24. It's not that bad. Yeah, they're still on 13. They can still even now take a hit. Flagellant's cool uh, not cool, the Flagellant's heal is on cool down, is what I mean to say. We do have a resolute. Hey. A bit lucky, but also a bit brilliant. Um, right. Unfortunately, she had been made blind, so... Once again, oh, that's that third time, I think, isn't it now? She's likely to die if she keeps getting hit like this. Just out of curiosity, what's her 
she's now on about a coin toss to die if she gets hit again uh, on to death's door we can't afford to lose healers right before we get to the sodden mountain so we really really want to try and clean you know, just finish this up here Boudicca's looking pretty bad as well. Thankfully for her, our heal is now off cooldown. And that's a hell of a heal! <laughs> Holy hell! Okay. annoying thing about bad relationships we've just got some awkward roles which mean that Damien and Bonnie keep getting intermittently blind um, six or three turns we could do with getting rid of that the main problem with this guy is that he just hits like a goddamn truck so the problem is not so much of it because it, it's that he can hit you from decent health to death uh, to death's door very easily. Um, right. I mean, I'd love to get that stress down a bit, but we've not had time to stress heal. We've been having to manage health more than anything else. Um, Enemy weakens and she's likely to yep go again please junior stop being useless she has to regain some health right we've got some nasty regen coming in as well as some nasty damage um deadly all the same Annoyingly, I'm probably going to end up using most of my little heals and things on this fight at this rate. Yeah, annoyingly. God, I'm not that. Ah, yeah, it's that altar. It's put that on now, hasn't it? Excellent. Okay. Um, heal yourself. Heal Junior. Foundation of trust. That's really not great. Just about to say that I bet there's bugger all we can do in that position with our vessel. Yep, yeah, there's a very real chance that we lose um, a, a healer here. A master stroke. As infuriating as that is, that we could just ah, thankfully he's got his little once per turn. Yeah, because he heals at the start of each round by himself automatically, doesn't it? Just a little bit, but it's enough to bring him out of death's door. That absolutely worth locking that perk in, it really was. We can do a bit of self-healing here. We just need to teeter him over the edge now, this guy. Right, self-heals are in. Wow. Um, heal much. <laughs> oh, that sodding blindness every time. Right, he's killed his mate. His bonus is gone. He's got the boss. He's got some regen. He has so much regen. We're on full. This shouldn't hurt that much. Yeah. It hurts, but it's not horrifically bad. What? How much damage does he do? Jesus Christ! We 
ridiculous. Kill the fat sod. Bleeding git. Get him. That's ridiculous, that. Absolutely ridiculous that he can hit for 38. Take my, you know, 73 health unit from like half to nearly dead. Well, to leave, yeah, they almost got him from the Death Star. Ridiculous, that. Yeah, it's the fact that he does massive sodding hits. Oh, God, and yeah, he's got an altar back now. At least the regen is gone. Six, seven, eight, nine. Use Deathless on her, you have to. Ooh, he's getting low, though. But we might have him here. He's down to nine. There we go. There's still, if you would please. Do the honors, you know? Okay. Well, you tried at An least. Interminable conflict. Oh, he's getting some... Mm, right, we need to finish him off right now. Um, let's see. Right, death cap spores. Reduce death blow resist by 33% there, so... Please say he didn't resist that. He didn't, right. 17% chance that he doesn't die. So he's gone. Um, let's stop everyone from freaking the hell out. Have a breather. Doesn't that thing just kill itself now, actually? If memory serves. That thing just explodes, doesn't it? So it can kind of use this moment to just give ourselves a little heal. Or, you know, a massive heal. Yeah, but it does hit you before it goes, right. And even then I used the stress heal to try and stop that and it wasn't enough. Ugh. We are through. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these fire resistance. And oh we don't want that for the end. Minus thirty percent damage after the first after each round. You'll get through the first boss stage and then be screwed. <laughs> we'll take all though, we've got the inventory space for it all. We'll do all the organisation at the start of the next run. Right. But that is going to be it, I think, for this one. We'll get to the inn. Three leagues out and counting. Two leagues, one league, and we are in. Thankfully, it looks like our uh, equipment that gives us, um, what's it, some restoratives has worked just before the end again. there. Because I saw, where is it? Yeah, we got two bottles just before the end just then. It looks like those smelling salts there as well. So we've got, we've got a few things we can use to heal at the end. Right. Cosmic Slayer. I think all the end uh, units now are cosmic. Steer and shroud scrounger. Okay. Items are cheaper. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Oh, they really are. Oh, increased stacking of pulses. That would have been great. We've got that and the mortar and pestle right at the beginning. Hm. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. We could as well get we another one before the end. Meet each challenge on its own terms. Anyway, for now though, that's going to do it. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on the next episode where it looks like, so what have we got here, the provisioner, discounted repairs, and item prices, we healed half, and yeah, just 
everything's on sale basically for this last bit because uh, I was doing that creature den and also being at the provisioner so yeah everything must go big end of game sale we'll buy up and we'll head on our merry way um, we'll see what we can do for relationships with say like some playing cards and uh, the songbook we'll see if there's anything we can do and just cross our fingers but we'll probably not be able to do much right next time the mountain thank you very much for watching and i'll see you in the next episode i'll see you then